Hello friends, uh, we often have a requirement where we need to measure uh, the performance of our, of our application with respect to memory and threads. Yeah, so we're going to talk about the same uh, how we can monitor memory and uh, threads and all those uh, uh, basic things about our Java application, right? So this is second video in uh, this series of Prometheus uh, monitoring. Yeah, so it's a simple thing that you need to do, right? Uh, two things that you need to define together with your Java process, right? One is you need to enable the JMX, right? And you need to provide a port to that, right? So this is the command, right? These are the commands that you need to provide together with your Java application startup, right? And uh, this is the command that you need to provide to initialize your uh, Prometheus node monitoring for uh, JMX related parameters right so I'm going to provide you uh, this jar uh, on my um, uh, github link all right so you need to define a port and I'll, I'll also provide you with the content of this yml file so as of now you just need to give star dot star and as part of the content of this particular file right unless you want to uh, specifically filter anything right and your simple java process uh, startup will look like this right where you give your memory arguments minimum and maximum right these are the parameters uh, same as this jmx parameters right and uh, below that you can just define your uh, prometheus related parameters right and your jar name and uh, yeah you start like that right and this particular port you need to give it in your prometheus yml file as well right to collect the data directly from uh, Prometheus right and uh, yeah that's it you just restart your Prometheus again and it will start collecting data for your this particular port right and it will give you the memory and thread related argument <coughs> thread related uh, parameters on your Grafana directly right so I hope you have already seen the vid first video how you basically need to monitor using Prometheus and Grafana right using, using a node exporter right so you know all the basic things you just need this particular jar you need this commands right to enable jmx and to enable this port for collection of the jmx parameter right and uh, yeah that's it and uh, it will look something like this right um, this is I'm, I'm going to go give you uh, the json file for this particular uh, dashboard as well right and uh, yeah this is how it will look right you can change according to your requirement and uh, if we look at the prometheus as well right all the parameters which are starting from jmx jvm right are the parameters which will be collected through this particular port right so you can see jvm thread peak and uh, deadlock monitor and uh, all the bytes minimum maximum and uh, uh, memory committed and uh, initialized and maximum and everything right it will also give you uh, gc related parameters as well right uh, number of counts and as uh, all those things right gc count gc time <coughs> threads use and uh, class loading and uh, all your minimum maximum average and current memory used right i hope you have liked this video right it's a basic and uh, a quick video in the next video, we'll talk about how to monitor all the Kafka related parameters using Prometheus. Yeah, thank you.